it was already. Time is one luxury we do not have. Let's save the rest for the road. This is what the Black Shores really looks like. Goodbye. And that's crazy. Right, this should go be messed up a little bit. So, let's jump into this. Oh, we're starting off with whatever her name was. I don't remember. Okay, it's time to look in. Well, well, look who I bumped into. A midnight ranger. Automatic. Bro, female rover, man. Ah, yeah. Rover. You're finally here. What a character. So you're the rover, huh? Delighted to make your acquaintance. This is Yuhu from Jinzhou. Like Mr. Chenpi, she's an expert in antiques. That's me! To uncover clues about hidden antiques, of course. Since Mount Firmament reopened, Master and I noticed artifacts from there popping up in the market. Oh, who would have known? Aside from Court of Savante gadgets, there are still plenty of mystery items that don't exactly scream Mount Firmament, you know? So? So? What? So I'm betting they're from the port city of Guishu. Yes. I remember you mentioned wanting to learn more about your past ties to the Black Shores. The battle in Norfolk Barrens is over, and the Black Shores should be withdrawing. But they've asked the Midnight Rangers to monitor the area around the port city of Guishu. I thought this might be your chance to gather more information about them. Okay. But you remember what I said? Huh? You, uh, brought it up before. Right, yeah. Like, ten years ago. Aw, oh, Yang Yang's got a soft spot for you, huh? Are you her special someone? Monka. Oh, come on. I... I just know it means a lot to you. Relax, I'm just teasing. So, you're tracking the Black Shores too. It's not this black room that Alto gave me. Should limit to them, right? You know what? Yang Yang's voice actress. She's doing it. Finally. Since we're on the same trail, I'm how not gonna lie. Up? Let this master be your guide. She's kind of doing it in the 1.2 story as well. Team. So that's Nothing's pretty good. Gonna slow us down. Nice. The dream team. Not to boast, but epic adventures tend to have a way of finding me. <clears throat> okay, I was going to say something, but I'm not going to say it. That first. It's kind of cringe. Okay. <clears throat> Let's see. She's actually so small, goddamn. I put on Naruto running. Hey. Which he heals. Wow. What was that? <laughs> okay, I'm gonna <clears throat> switch off on the character. That's weird. These parameters are correct, but British. nothing's happening. What's going on? What's going on? Are you a bloomberry from the Black Shores? Yes. Need something? Okay, you're just gonna reveal that, like. Oh. Isn't the Black uh, Shores so like a thing? You're the one Alto invited earlier. The one and only. Oh, sorry. I, I didn't recognize you. Well, you better. Golden pupils and this Blake Bloom. Yeah, it's you, all right. I'm Nia, a bloom bearer from the Black Shores. Didn't expect to meet someone as important as you under these circumstances. I know it's unusual, but could you help me out now that we're working together? Oh, I haven't decided if I want to join the Black really? Shores. But Uncle mentions you'll be joining soon. Is what's going on first? Actually, we're monitoring abnormal parameters. Yeah, and listen to Encore, because she obviously knows what's going on. <laughs> to be taken back to the Black Shores. The port city of Guishu was decimated by the lament. 
If this frequency goes unchecked, lament. it could trigger another catastrophe. Lament. No, the lament. Yes. Six really that that's high? why the Tether system sent us to locate and recover this frequency as soon as possible to prevent a potential disaster. Our agents relay the disaster. Since then, I've lost contact with them, which doesn't sit well. I'm stuck here monitoring. Can't leave my post. Do you think you could help check out what happened? If things aren't looking good, we might need to inform Jinjo City Hall, like we did before. Damn, another like Frenodian already. Shit. Or like whatever is that, like disaster, right? That's the worst like equivalent to the Fredonian. If we contain the frequencies that Tether's system advises, nothing bad will happen. Okay. Want to help her. As an outrider, sure. it's my duty to safeguard the peace. You're right. We can't just sit this one out. And like we ever sit Thank anything you. out. It's right? reassuring to have a midnight ranger with us. I'll send you the coordinates of the abnormal frequency. By the way, what do you mean by abnormal frequency? Could be the reverberations or something in the sonora spheres. In Solaris, frequencies can be anything. Okay. One thing's for sure, though. This frequency represents gravity. It's abnormal because it has its own gravitational center. You should be able to feel a palpable anomaly near it. But we have to climb all up that thing. Oh. I trust you'll handle it smoothly, but remember, your safety matters most. Don't hesitate to retreat if you run into any real danger. And once you're back, we'll hurry to the Black Shores to upload it to the Tether system. Oh, I forgot you haven't been to the Black Shores, oh. have you? Not yet. No worries. At least. I'll be your guide then. Cool. Nia. <gasps> oh, well, here we go. Who's this guy? Part of the story? New Final Fantasy Defense comes out tomorrow. So I have to walk a week to get my shell credits. Why is that guy walking for money? I don't know. And what's the next subway? Just tell me to wait one way long. Make your favorite dishes. Well, I mean, I can see where this is going already. I feel like some cinema's gonna happen soon. You want to spread a glance at the stars above? I was gonna remember, revere the stars, why don't you fade into history? Yikes. Oh my, where's my pocket watch? Oh, I sent it for the purchase day. How come I forgot something just, from just yesterday? Um, Alzheimer's, I guess. I sense the presence of tacit discords below. You don't say. What's the big deal? Just some pawns. I won't even break a sweat. Something feels different about them. Be careful. <laughs> yeah, I guess I'll kill this guy as well, since he's just like looking at me like that. Leave it to me. Diminish. Moment of awakening. Take four. Actually, let me do one more thing. I don't think you have the weapon. The impatient ones will fall right into our lap. That's right. I was wondering what the critter was solo. Okay, there we go. She is healing. It's a work in progress. That's why it looks like that. happening okay that was weird Sacred life. but i blew up at the end forgive me yeah that, those were some weird tacit discords that's for sure what's this red shit what Like Black Shores, guys. Well, they're just disappearing, I guess. It's too late. So, they're the agent 
once Nia was waiting for. Damn, already. What happened here? Hi. Fighting it. This is my name. I once lived under it as a bloom bearer. Is this your doing with the bloom bearers? Look here, they even know what lament means. Yeah, I mean, what do you know about Black Shores? Oh, your brain opening. This voice looks, goes kind of crazy. No, no, they want you to become a part of them. I can't let it happen. Run, run. What you seek. Is on the girl. She has it. Ugh. What does any of this have to do with me? Where did it go? No, wait. Don't go over there. Must be the normal frequency the Black Shorts want to recover. The remaining frequency there is in extreme chaos. It's dangerous. Hold on. Hey, what's happening? It's starting to glow. It must be from the Black Shores. Look at this. So a rhythm light seemingly harboring some form of frequency. Okay. I need to learn more about this thing. My master and I guessed it's from the Black Shores, and now it looks like we were right. The abnormal frequency definitely links to the deaths of those bloom bearers. Okay. Now it's hiding in this object, but I can still feel its strong attachment to the black shores. Solving this issue is beyond our capabilities. Besides, they also mentioned Rover and the fall of the port city of Guishu. We should meet with that bloom bearer first and explain the situation. This is best left to the experts. So they died to the frequency, and the frequency just wanted to her item. Something like that. Let's go. I have a bad feeling about this. I mean, yeah, you know, just a couple of people My died. There's more to this than meets the eye. Port City of Guishu must hold secrets waiting to be discovered. Wow. I mean, surely, like, you can't come in this area without doing that exploration mission, right? That gets rid of the thing that kills you. I wonder if that's, like, a requirement to, like, start in the story mission. Oh, you have to do this exploration mission. Cinema. Oh, my God. The black bars. Oh. It's happening. 
Or, but we don't know you. We don't know you like that. Damn. I'm looking. Astral modulation. Oh, just got teleported. Character. Uh, I mean, I've come on the port a bunch of times, but I've never seen you. Anyway. Ah, so that's how we get teleported to the Black Shores. Mm. Oh, that was quick. Name. The wandering traveler. Traveler. Last, you have returned. I have. Here, the story I came ends and begins back. anew. I am pleased to see you back on these shores. Same. Wherever you venture, be it Huang Long or Rinesita, I will always be here, waiting. No matter how far you wander, you will always find me here, on these black shores. Okay. So we just teleport to the mirror, eh? A different approach. Oh my god, look at this map. I don't know what I mean. Okay, well it looks like it'll be as big as mom for a moment. Yeah. As far as the eye. Alright, I'm about see. to go bring that from exploring. We cannot wait. But first it's story time. Hey. Onwards. That is water, bro. So blue. Thick fog blocks the way ahead. But I like this game, come on. Oh my god. It's just such a vibe, low key. So nice. At your disposal. In war with time. Strike as one, heaven ordains. Bad show, boys. Fluorescent shadows. Around the echo and caves. The oh my god, that's so peak. Like, riches. actually, it's crazy. Wait, hold up. Give me a second. This. Okay, I feel like it's a good thing that I got Shorekeeper and her weapon. <gasps> Nova, yes, that's perfect. That's exactly what I need. For your needs. Tell me if there's anything else you want. Oh yeah, this guy. <laughs> but why is the fog still so thick? I can't even see you. Because you're at Veiled Rock. Is it? The is veiled. Is it now? Now. How about oh, this guy's VA cooked. What brings you here, uninvited guests? What? I can say my name at least. <gasps> is it? Is it really you? No. No, don't let this be a dream. <laughs> At last, you've come to me, to the Black Shores. What is the Black Shores? Why is this close to Huang Long? Precisely. <laughs> Damn. But how did you manage to get here? Don't worry. 
You can talk to them and that led to your arrival I here. See. The situation doesn't look good. That Hoda might not be one of us. But I'm curious. Could I have a look at that item the antique dealer gave you? No. Huh. Didn't expect to see it outside Mount Firmament. This is where it came from. A monitoring also. register. We Black Shores members place these around the world to keep an eye on the Sentinels. If anything happens to them, we'll know immediately. Oh, so like Jew and stuff. Like he was also used to record abnormal frequencies in the port city of Guishu. Why was I teleported here? Maybe the Tethy system has a soft spot for you. But without more details, I can't say for sure. Since your arrival. Wait, if your keyboard is like a computer AI, AI. there's no way. A person in light blue. Huh. Could it be the shorekeeper? The shorekeeper. Hmm. Yes. The elusive guardian of the Black Shores, who is said to be always watching our true leader, shielding us from danger. It seems you've had quite the encounter. In times of great adversity, the shorekeeper will reveal herself and support our true leader, who at the destined moment, will arise to save and guide the Black Shores. Fantastical or not, that's all we've got to go on. Hmm. I mean, sounds about right. There must be a reason this point. she went to such lengths for you. <clears throat> anyway, let's not get carried away. We should head to the greenhouse. The abnormal frequency you collected needs to be uploaded to the Tethys system as soon as possible. In order to avoid another lament, lament. Guishu, given that we've already lost enough of our own to it, we need more bloom bearers to handle this. As for the information you're after, it's already spread this far. Seems like the Tethys malfunction is getting worse. We need to hurry. Time is one luxury we do not have. Let's save the rest for the road. Act 8. God damn. Who's that guy? It's like a butler, I guess. A robot. <laughs> what happened here? Okay. Are you over? So Why is she talking like that? Yang Yang was freaking out. Someone must have teleported us away from the port city of Guishu when things went south. You know, in the blink of an eye, we were back in Jinzhou. Hey, is that the sea behind you? No. <laughs> no, when Yang Yang wanted to talk to me. It happens a lot around here. Unlucky. The Black Shores sits atop a massive tacitite. Wreaking havoc on standard communications. Once you reach the greenhouse, you can pass them in near a beacon. Echoes of the past. Only our beacons can cut through the Tacitite's interference. Cool. A lot of blue butterflies. Bird. What? He escaped. How dare he? Wait. Give me a quick second. There's too many exclamation marks on my screen. Understood. I don't like it. I am here to serve your will. I see my way clear. Okay. Sure. Huh. Dylan is quiet and serene. 
that these islands have deliberately formed their circle, leaving a void in the center. Cool. I mean, now we can see the map. Oh, well, kinda. Well, there's anything. I mean, since it's like explorable, there has to be something between. Yes, I want to talk to Finally our girlfriend, I guess. Hey, you scared us to death. Why is she here? So I'm in the black shorts now. Glad to know you're all right. She shows yeah. like you. Just so you know, yeah. the black shorts warning, so we cranked up the defenses in Jinzhou. The Midnight Rangers are preparing to secure the port city of Guishu and... Oh, <sighs> I'm pretty serious. The first in-game waifu. She's really trying to hold on to that title, I guess. It's <laughs> crazy. Forgive me. Therefore, I can upload the data. You apparently you can do it. Comes to classic games on a tier one thousand two hundred. If you don't stand a chance against me, not in the slightest. Is that a talking robot? Why ain't he well, talking though? In a sense, yes. They're directly linked to the Tethys system. Their voice frequencies are encoded into languages we can understand. If you think about it, they could be considered a unique living race of their own. Right. As for the Tethys system, makes sense. I guess. Supercomputer. The Black Shores relies on its calculations to observe forewarn and solve anything lament related anyway lament. let me introduce you to coup money they manage the cash flow and keep tabs on robot terminals across the region they're the shrewd profiteer of the black shores you can't call me that every move i make it blah, blah. easy there let's get back to i can't this. read the recent quake stirred up tacitite's interference How's your underground connection holding? It's like a poker face. Look solid. No, his status is up. We're okay. That's comforting. Hey, you can give the abnormal frequency to Koo Money. They'll handle the upload. Koo Money. It's a new rookie. We'll see if it's not the abnormal frequency of Port City. How's the upload? Already sent the data back to Tethys? Yeah. What's going on? I've never seen this series. The Tethys system has been shaky lately. You've noticed, right? What's worse, along with the data, we've received some terrible news. The bloom bearers we sent to the port city of Guishu. We lost them all. How did that happen? What happened in that city? Since you're linked to the Tethys' data bank, can you check if there's a bloom bearer named Hoda registered? She might have something to do with the deaths of our people. <gasps> he has to be able to control gravity. I am un tired. <laughs> she referred to herself as we. She was above frozen and blue bears by name come up with anything. I don't know such an ability either. Our control sounds far fetched. Soon I believe in someone minting shell credits. I like it like this in the universe. Keep me posted if you find one. Yes. Let's show you that they generate 37. Take 70, take the 30. Says Mr. Cheapskate. Sure. Almost forgot. Take this. Take hard. For me? Find me when you burn through it all. That's not fair. You've never given me that much before. 
And money loves to me in games. It was all you had left. I need a greenhouse. Paradise outside the Black Shores. We bring the body back and keep Monica in the loop. Monica? I just don't know born as usual. There's still a lot to do. Kumani is right. Just in case, the Tethys system is very likely to send out a warning to Jinjo about an imminent lament in the port city of Guishu. As for Hoda, if she's a bloom bearer, there should be a record of her in the system. And if such a resonator existed, the Black Shores would definitely know. Hold on. Uh, there's another possibility. You're not from the Black Shores? Yeah, that's one possibility. Not to worry. If the machine route doesn't work, there's another way. Let's go to the greenhouse. Most of us like to gather there. And Monica, our chief administrator, is stationed there as well. Okay. I wonder if... What's called about the robot? What is there to ask? Hey, what's in your mind? Can robots grow this hair for money too? You ever play those RPGs? Each character's got a backstory, right? Well, the, the Tethys system gives them all their own personality. Okay, nice. Skip. Take Kumani, for instance. Tethys programmed it to be a crafty deal maker. Who knows? Maybe one day you'll come across a robot you really click with. Once you're ready, we'll head over to the greenhouse and meet Monica. Or I am indeed ready. Be swift. This guy charging. Oh, yeah, he is. That's funny. Hello. Oh, she's Monica. Okay. She looks chill. I guess. Halto, there you are. And this is. The rover just arrived. She's the one we invited earlier. The mysterious resonator who appeared in Jinjo. So you're the resonator who confronted the Thranodian. I honestly didn't expect to meet you in person. <clears throat> Sorry, I got a bit carried away. My name's Monica, the chief administrator, or <clears throat> housekeeper, around here. Hello. I was supposed to show you around, but things are quite hectic right now. My apologies. Sure. You heard about what happened in Guishu, right? Yes. We received word from Jinjo City Hall about their actions. We also alerted them to the Tethys system's likely warning of a potential lament in the port city of Guishu. The data lament. you brought back has been uploaded to the system, but as you know, Tethys has been unstable. So the problem isn't solved. Exactly. We need Tethys functioning normally to fully resolve this. But retrieving the abnormal frequency was a significant step forward. Those bloom bears didn't sacrifice themselves in vain. It could have been much worse if they hadn't risked their lives to transmit the coordinates back to Nia. And thank you for risking your life to retrieve the data. What's the current situation? Efforts to stabilize the Tethys system are underway. Good to hear. By the way, since you deal with all our contacts, does the name Hoda ring any bells? She claims to be a bloom bearer. Hoda? No, I don't recall any bloom bearer by that name. Why do you ask? Tell Monica what happened. So she kills everyone. To that abnormal frequency. Maybe she's a traitor. That theory doesn't hold water. Not only are traitors incredibly rare in our history, they're all documented. And there is no record of her in the system. Was she trying to mislead us? Somebody was once part of the Black Shores. Hmm, that's strange. 
because we just added you to the recruitment list recently. Yeah, she's quite the mystery. Monica, can you try to gather more info about this Hoda for us? Of course. If it concerns the security of the Black Shores, it's my job. <sighs> if this person was Wait, so truly they, actually, they don't know that I'm the leader of the Black Shores. Frequency, Damn. She could be responsible for those deaths. Is there anything in that abnormal frequency? Did we just upload it to it. We've been tricked. We just put it back into Tethys. Careful. Oh. I see. So we're dead. Seems about right. Well, looks like she's made herself at home in Tethys. I'll check with Ku Money to assess the current situation underground. We need to do everything in our power to protect Tethys from any harm. Could you please accompany Alto to the greenhouse? We need you to find the Kuwata robots. Also, ensure the modulation device in the greenhouse remains secure. Oh, I'm sorry. You were meant to have a pleasant time here. When the dust clears, I'd like to formally welcome you to join us. Sure. Damn. We got played. Fun into broker like you always stayed cold headed. I'm frustrated with myself. Got too carried away by your presence to think straight. I thought we could easily resolve what does that, that mean? by what did I do? the data you brought back to the system. Never considered the possibility of an infiltrator lurking inside. We need to figure out who's behind all this. So that the system mean that's much to the Black Shores. Yeah. The Black Shores every move hinges on its decisions, big or small. Without Tethys, it'd just be a barren tacitite. And if you're after the truth, you'll need its assistance too. What should I do now? Actually, Ku Money, Monica, and I don't have top clearance to the Tethys system. Well, but guess who does? Limited with higher clearance. Or I guess her, right? I'll cover the answers you're looking for. All right, let's pick up the pace. We need to find the Ku Water siblings and check on the modulation device. This is your chance to ask anything. You won. If anyone really? has answers, it's Tethys. I can't guarantee you'll get everything you're after. But it's worth a shot, right? The greenhouse is just ahead. Let's move. We are moving. <laughs> Hello, I am moving. <laughs> greenhouse. <laughs> La la la, happy watering. Grab my sweet little flowers. Ah, oh, don't see couple like that. Chill, bro. I need help. Right now. How are you watering the flowers? Of course, I keep a gardener. I also give ultimate care to all these flowers. Happy watering. Pruning airing and giving them chance sunshine. Cool. So where's the modulation device? Upside in the piano, that's the modulation device. So that's why Shortkeeper plays the piano. Okay. Hold up, please plant a flower. What? Plant a flower. Lovers marry plants of flower here. Most choose flowers it's from their hometown. What flower did Camellia plant? So she had an entire garden of flowers. Carver seed, would you like to plant from your your hometown? I don't remember where I'm from. I'm sorry, one flower traveler, right? Then a black bloom will probably suit you well. A black bloom? Of course, even if you don't remember your hometown, the Black Shores can be on your home. The Black Blooms we give each member symbolize that. I belong here? Yeah, you could say that. 
Um, like, what are you feeling? You're getting the same feeling, right? Hey, you look familiar, but I can't remember where we met. Press request, no response. The Tete system reacted to your face. Oh. What? Strange, I found a record of you in the system, but suddenly disappeared. Ooh. Oh, why did Tetris suddenly tell us to leave? Alright, let's go cool water. Cool money is waiting for us. Ah, so the Tetris wants a one on one. Okay, see you next time. See ya later. I'm gonna try to the Tetris system. The two robots leave. They have left. Yeah, the Tetris system is hiding something from you. However, Kubota and Kuplan have already been have already departed. Oh, it's so fast. I couldn't read, man. Wait. Inspect. Camera seems deeply connected to flowers. The seed of fate. Maybe she's more like a flower than you realize. Looks like it's not your tree. But it seems Alto took the liberty name that money tree. Or something he would do. Okay. <laughs> I couldn't bring any seeds back from our hometown. hometown. This might be similar to our own story. The flowers in the tail truly be real. Mm. I shall press the keys. Piano is playing by itself. Ah, do you know how to play the piano? Yes, with my brain, because it's so big. Now it's in that by itself. I guess the Black Shores have earned their mysterious reputation. They even have a self-playing piano. Try to touch a key. Piano seems to respond to your touch. So you do know how to play. I guess so. Keep touching. I don't have a musical bone in me, but that sounded good. <laughs> Keep touching. In every sound and frequency lies an emotion. Just like this. Expressing what's on your mind through music. It's something even you can do. You'll give it a try, won't you? Hey! Damn. Wake up! What was that? Did I just see? The shorekeeper. Uh, what? It's just been the two of us here this whole time. Whoa! Another earthquake! Uh, what's happening? Run! We need to get out of here! Oh, well. I guess the action is about to start. <laughs> No. There is a spike in the anchor frequency of the Tethys algorithmic array. It caused other abnormal frequencies to escape. Analysts are still investigating. We're already en route for repairs. Right now, the data stored in Tethys is materializing by drawing energy from the massive Tassotype beneath the Black Shores. It's making digital constructs out of real life entities. Ku Money already logged your info in Tethys. Now you can command the robots across the Black Shores to fix and upload the corrupted data. That'll restore the anchors. We're heading to Veiled Rock's anchor. Rover, can you help at the Haven of Sprouts? It's our comms hub. I'll be helping with the repair at Veiled Rock. Such a pity I won't be there to witness Jinjo's savior in action once more. No, I'll miss seeing my friend in action again. Oh, maybe that's why you saw so the happy other over comms, mate. It's not that deep. I'm so sleepy. Or Loki, I haven't liked a single line that Abby has said so far. So that's great. You're finally here. Cookie. Ah, that is sent me to assist you. 
Welcome to the Venus Sprouts, where Black Shores members live and rest. Anchor here is a communication link in all beacons worldwide. Currently, the leak of the data has been spreading. Yes. But times are on our side, and our agents are on a damage control, so they're underway. Okay, tell me how I can help. As we correct the system, I give you clearance and collect all the bad stuff up. But for it to work, you can't go too far from me. This is this is limit. Well, they're not touch the crap data, they still pose a threat. I see some nearby, why don't we start your housekeeping over there? Just aim on boom, easy peasy. Cookie top cleaners activated. Clearance issued. Hey, what? Oh, I see, I have to get close to it. Oh, that's pretty cool. Okay. Get out! Okay. What's next? Yeah, I need to escape a lot of Kuman, you said. But be careful, this cover data is dangerous. The authorized keys are one time use and work within a limited range. They deactivate after one use. Please use. You should. Let's proceed. Indeed. You shall be cleared. <laughs> hey, I could go on your feet, huh? How'd you get down here? I'm here all along. No more spot left. I'm for another real area or something. Luckily, uh, not all the leak data is corrupted. So it helps us. Clearance issue, let's proceed. Oh, Miss Shorekeeper, she is here. Wait, but before that, clear this. Thanks, bro, for the small chest. Please have them. I hope they will prove useful. I will indeed have them. Ouch. Stop it. And that was it, just one cube. Oh my god, I see you, Mr. Chest. Turn down, I seem to have settled. This is the beginning of a new story. Wow, the island was empty. Its geographical coordinates remain unchanged. Everything is as it was. Even time leaves no traces on the Tacitite. This world has not yet begun. But we have already seen its end. They too will be as fragile and lost as we once were. But this time, we will show them what we believe in. What was that? A memory. An illusion caused by those abnormal frequencies? But it felt all too real. Hello? Can you hear me? Ah, uh, Rover. Thanks to you, the abnormal frequency index in the Haven of Sprouts has dropped. The island ahead is the Eye of Asteria, the highest point in the Black Shores. It monitors the etheric sea across all of Solaris. Since the Tacitite there is more powerful, the interference is stronger, so there is not as much infrastructure there. It's quite close to the Haven of Sprout. Okay. The robot is already there, waiting for you. Now is you're talking. Anything of interest? <gasps> the wind rises. At your disposal. Like some gang wars, what the fuck's going on there? <laughs> hey. 
Yo. What's up? Whoa, you're fast. Not you again. Okay, so that's my responsibility. For your team will craft the data, right? The anchor is the eye of Asteria. As you may not to blah blah. So we already turned on the anchor inside the anchor. Well, the switch is here to use the grapple. They help you climb out to the top of the anchor. Yeah, but we can get from maybe it's a good place to start. Clumsy shoot. Let's proceed. Oh yeah. Give me some anchor points. Ouch. Yeah, I'm glad that these are back actually, because they're like a little fun as fuck. I wonder like that one dungeon that had this like 2D thing. That was fun. Fighting at your disposal, no mercy. My field of expertise. <sighs> Together we fight. Take flight. <sighs> Sacred life. Than the pieces. Zap string. It's our curtain call. <sighs> Astral modulation. Loading. <sighs> Strike is one. Heaven ordains. Spanish all vice. Modulation. modulation looks sick just floating and the eye of a stair has been cleared the story oh. is unfolding the lament is not an entirely unpredictable natural disaster to confront one's enemy the lament. One must first understand them however even now we can only anticipate and warn of the laments coming advanced predictions including those of the etheric sea and the tacit fields Remain beyond our reach. Our battle against the lament cannot be won by a chosen few. Every soul must join. The lament is our shared enemy. Tearing apart the land and ripping people from their homes. Their lives. It will take everyone to build a world that can thrive amidst so much ruin. This is something only we, as human beings, can achieve. Another one? Is this how the Black Shores was founded? It was like looking at a mirror into the past. Oh, it's really happy, isn't it? That stair is quite nice. That was for sightseeing. Come save me. It's my task in the in the TV Observatory. Yeah, yeah. is where we observe tacit discords across the world to predict the lament. It handles data collection, storage, and transmission of anything related to these creatures. That's why this place is the trickiest. We had a severe leak in data. You'd better find the robot first. It's familiar with this place. Watch out! More tacit discords incoming! Okay. Evil be cleansed. 
Man, I really need the other one. Oh, no, I did. Yeah. Was the rotary keeper? Yo. Thank you. I'm the keeper of the TD Observatory. That was an impressive battle. I've heard about your skills from my colleagues in Jinjo. Marlon? Yes, but regardless of our origins, we're united by a common ideal here. While you were busy cleaning house, we took the opportunity to reconnect to the Tethys system at the Haven of Sprouts. Since data can materialize using the energy of the Tacitite, we can harness it to our advantage. Now we have input data near the anchor, enough to form a climbing platform. Let's drive those monsters back to where they belong. The repair personnel for the first two anchors are on their way. It's now or never. I shall lead the way. Ten. Okay. Your time is on my field of expertise. Strike is one. Our lights shine through. <sighs> Onwards. Yo, no, never, no, never. Your parrot. And a good. That line a good resume. Excuse me. But the roll set now. As long as we're ready, you can start the final step. Clearance issued. To victory. Where's the platform? That was kind of like trippy. And goodbye. Here we okay. I guess we have to do it again. At your disposal. In war with time. Together we fight. Take flight. Thunder guide us. And goodbye. Huh. Of course, you can crit. Why would you crit? Laser beam. Hey, okay. In the last batch of corrupted data has been cleansed in the TD Observatory. The primordial sea. <laughs> Gorgeous of spirits. I can only go as far as you commanded. From the etheric Wait, that what map is called in the game. From time to space. Hey, Yingying, Yang, look! Somebody's over there! <gasps> She was there. Is she dead? Or just unconscious? Damn. Your story begins here. Go forth. I am forever by your side. So she the one that... Oh, you scared me. Just fell from above all of a sudden. Don't worry. It's all part of the plan. There's no spare parts and oil here. Take them all. Mm, I don't know about that. Thank you, but I'm good. Those are already stored now. Other units have finished repairing the anchor at Veil the Rook too, and they'll be here soon. Oh my god, Fu Yin Lin was in the story for a sec. I was like, what? <laughs> Out of all people. I still such a shame that we'll never see her again. Unlucky. <laughs> Alright! All the repairs are finally done. 
thank you for your help. Yeah. Without you leading the charge, we would have barely made it. Uh. Uh, you are Hoda. Oh, I forgot to tell you. We finally found out her true identity. She wasn't lying when she said she was a bloom bearer. She worked as a field medic, but more importantly, she died in the lament that destroyed the port city of Guishu a few hundred years ago. In short, she couldn't be alive. Yeah, so those reverberations were from like the lament or something when it happened, right? In the Tethy system, our registered name is Necrostar. And that sounds metal, okay. We are forever trapped on the event horizon of the black hole, falling into an unending darkness. Falling. Beneath the lament's wheels, we are but dust, pitiful souls, cursed to suffer dreadful eternity, denied the solace of death. My mentor, the one I follow. Please, I beg you to end this Mobius loop, this endless cycle. Hello? Welcome home. Okay. You stand on these shores once more. Welcome home. See him back in the port of I wish to keep you from any harm. Or something. Forgive me for acting on my own accord. Was that you on the beach before? Hmm. Hmm? Why do you look so sad? Such emotions are not mine to show. Yes, it was I. Long ago, when you first brought the Black Shores into existence on this island, I assisted you in managing this place. Okay. You once wove the threads of this world together, but then you left, roving the boundaries between this realm and the next. Roving. I don't remember any of this. You have lost far more than just your memories. But the Black Shores. Since your departure, the Tethys system has been the sole leader of the Black Shores. Most have never seen you, and that is all by your design. Built by your hands, holds all its resources at your disposal. You have more important matters to attend to than dealing with everyday trifles. That is why you entrusted the Tether system with the Black Shores governance. This time, it makes sense. only you have the ability to end all of this completely. To end what? This is also your first step towards the future. You mean... Tell a shopkeeper what happened in the poor city of Guishu. She was indeed a bloom bearer, but mysteries still surround her and the departed. The departed whom you saw in the port city of Guishu caused those abnormal frequencies. Only you can mend those errors. Rest assured, I shall always be by your side to assist you as before. What happened back then? I am sorry, but I must keep this secret from you. Perhaps, okay. as you restore the tether system, 
you will uncover the reasons for severing ties with your past. Wandering traveler, please tell me. Are you satisfied with your journey and stories in Jinjo? Sure, yeah, it's been a good start. In Solaris, Jinjo is but the beginning of your journey. Please have faith. The path ahead shall be as splendid as you desire. What is a dev's token? <laughs> or what? The gate to the underground has been opened. Yeah, what's up, Alex? Just wanna follow. Pass through it, and you will reach the depths of the Black Shores. Your journey has only just begun. Beyond the Black Shores lies Solaris itself. Before you go, can I ask a favor? No. When all is settled, will you share your stories from Jinjo with me? I mean, how can you say no to that face, right? Damn. Okay. Stuff is happening. Cool. Ugh, I'm gonna get that just later. I ain't climbing up all that. Alto. She's the shorekeeper. She even sure shows up in person. That means I haven't seen the shorekeeper I am in him. all my time. Indeed. In Black Shores. I've only heard the stories about her. If the shorekeeper is revealing herself to you, it could only mean one thing. I think you know what I mean. The gateway to the underground has been opened. I'm sure. The answers lie ahead. Go on. Leave the rest to us, buddy. Damn. Head to the Stargate. The Stargate. Okay. Is it like an easy way to do that? Can I ride the boat? No. Would these be enough for your needs? Tell me if there's anything else you want. Oh, we're not gonna add like a water walking character. That's what we need. Huh. Damn, this looks insane, no? We are going in. Okay. God, these visuals, though. Damn. Oh, is this like where she is? Or keeper? Black Shores Underground. Okay, I see. I was wondering, because the map above ground seemed like kind of small. But like half of it is underground, I guess. So I guess that makes sense. Um, Cool. Yo, help. Oh, you're finally awake. I thought you fell sore that you wouldn't be able to make it. Where am I? You're the bank of life. As you can see, it's an underground seed bank. Okay, somebody in the underground area, huh? Yes. Usually no one comes to the back left except the shorekeeper. Where is the shorekeeper? I can remember she seems to have never left this place. And the back alive once in a while, choosing a plant, flower to plant in her own garden. She hasn't come for a very, very long time. It's been 20 years, 5 months and 17 days since her last visit. Right. Okay, I like the hat, bro. 
They need to go to the data hub where the stellar mattresses. I mean, collection of the stars are stored. Okay, should we probably to visit trying to fix it to visit. Sugar places a trust in you, then you shall have our trust to you. Thank you. Come on, you should do information with us through the Tetis. Tetis. Tetis system. Right, TH is such an annoying thing to say in English. Uh, I don't know how to take care of plants, and I can't do much in this situation. I want to help the Black Shores. My home is in crisis. I'll give it to the shopkeeper. Thanks, bro. Go straight ahead, and you leave the Bank of Life. Thanks, bro. Put a key of the base to activate other mechanisms. Okay. Any chest, though. Hello. Examine the greenhouse of camellias. Interesting. That is terminal. Terminal. <laughs> I'm getting confused, okay. By the way, try this. I've also gained a new part to help you. Ta-da! So now I'm gonna use the Black Shores. You can use this device to open a portal between two spaces. Try shooting it at the data wall. Okay. Oh, yeah, it's like the portal 2 thingy. Alright, so the Black Shores can use the device to open a portal between two spaces. Opening passageways between different spaces uses the spatial properties of the sonorosphere. Thus, the tether system can hold nearly infinite data. Mm -hmm. It is akin to a collection of sonorospheres. Yes, very interesting. You also. Left the key upstairs, actually for the portal. Okay. The lands of Jinzhou are filled. But this POV is like kind of messing me up. I'm not gonna lie. I don't know why. Hold the elevator. Damn, it's literally just floating. Okay. Like no moving bits, no nothing. Shorekeeper teaches I am not a mo uh, go straight and leave the bank of life. Cool Irwin. What's up, Irwin? The great chain of being. There is one someone welcome knowledge seeker. You look just like Kumani. The Kumani then his robot on the Black Shores archipelago. Ultimately, each area of the Black Shores underground has been assigned an administrator and co when administrator of the Bank of Life. Enter for species conversation. Conservation. Pleasure. Is a hurricane at the moment the fatal Black Shores underground is in your hands and the shore keepers now. We'll talk again. Yay. Saulius. What's up? Nice hat. Consoler, why haven't you evacuated yet? When the Tetis is system issued order to evacuate everyone else left up for the modulation hall. So why are you still here? Check the seeds in Mac Life, seeds collect from all over the world. It's imperative that the plants of Solaris be kept to her systematically, you see. Besides, as long as the Tetis system stands, so will we. Oh, so plants have like some crazy meaning. Because I mean that's why you use them to like level up characters as well. And they have some crazy meaning here as well. Numbers are a complete mess. They should have been arranged using a phylogenic something. You want to help? Keep yourself safe. That's your first priority. <laughs> K. Y. Safe. No? Uh, here, there's a Jinjo score name, but Verena was well versed in botany. And we'll again, just meet her soon. Ooh. I'll be a crossover. Maybe with Ancor. Damn. We were underground. This is what the Black Shores really looks like. 
Okay, so you're just a projection, right? To be exact, my body is composed of sonoro spheres, and the projection you see is but a shadow of the sonoro. My head. Okay. I cannot leave my post. As the core computational unit of the tether system, I must remain to ensure its proper functioning. Yet, I still wish to be with you. This is the only way. Great. In a sky like this down here is a real surprise. Exactly. This place holds records of every lament across Solaris. Those that have passed. Those happening now. And those yet to come. Here, a planet's lament transforms into stars that fill the sky. Well, I called me the Astral Modulator. Does that have something to do with this place? Astral Modulator, guide of civilizations, mastermind of the Black Shores. Before you severed ties with your past, it was indeed one of your names. Perhaps you have a preference? This game looks so good, damn. What did you call me? Me. Hey, what did you call me? I would call you by your true name. I have My always true name. addressed you as such. In the past and present, through countless years. That is the Necrostar, once known in ancient astronomy as a black hole. The tether system transforms data into stars, observing the entire Solaris, and discarded data are cast into the Necrostar. Mm -hmm. The abnormal frequency you encountered in the port city of Guishu is part of it. Or rather, it is the Necrostar itself. Okay. Please, bring it back to the modulation hall, and I shall correct it. Then, the tether system will be restored, and harm will be no more. My only hope now, is that we are not too late. Go ahead. I am always with you. Well, this music was kind of crazy, by the way. Yeah. Though I am but a projection, I've been by your side all along. I'll stand by you until the very end of this journey. Ooh, more flowers. I don't have enough now. Huh? Oh no, I still need like these other materials. Your will. Which will be from the upcoming boss, I'm sure. Any moment. Ooh, a chest. For free. It appears the Necrostar has been successfully contained underground and the gate is now sealed. I saved the robot. Good. There's no Stop. To waste. Stop it. Crush them. That's Leave right. the robot alone. It's our curtain call. They came out of nowhere. Yeah. Why did these guys blow up? That's annoying. Wait, get out of radius, man. Okay. Hi. Onwards. Let's get the robots at uh, the charging station. I'm rescuing. A different approach. I shall lead the way. Tear them to pieces. My field of expertise. Huh. Moment of awakening. 
Onwards. Hundred and eighty K. Damn. Not bad. Onwards. Not bad at all. Forgive me. Cuche scupare. Okay. Pare. Like, fuck you, you day. That's the discords are such a pain, like, it will go no way to get rid of them. So, they have important things to do, right? Go on, then leave the resource. Madame Beatrice and the agents also need your help. Then we'll keep the station secure. Okay. The frying pans of justice. Damn. What happened here? Oh. Not like this. You're safe. It's okay now. Beatrice? Hello? I, I heard her voice. Yes, she's here. Don't worry, you'll be fine. I'm here with you now. Stay with us. The medical team will arrive any minute. I fulfilled my duty as a member of the Black Shores. Your effort won't be wasted. We will restore everything to normal and ensure everyone's safety. Thank you. Please stop them. Oh. We will. Have a good rest now. You've done enough. Your oh, she's not dead. Nice. Will shine bright like the stars. A beacon or... for all to see. What happened? An entire necrostar was forcefully discharged into the error cell without warning. The error code spilled out as a result. At its worst, it looked a lot like virtual blood seeping through the ground. We had to seal the underground gate to protect the control room, but someone had to retrieve the key. He did what was necessary. Even if it meant risking his own life. I admit, I am surprised to see the shorekeeper here. How's the agent doing? He is severely infected with abnormal frequencies. It could be fatal. Okay, so he's not actually dead, okay. Wondering. It appears the Necrostar has been successfully contained underground and the gate is now sealed. Look at that star up. It's black inside. It's not activated. However, you must open a second portal to create a connection between the two. Indeed. Where? With my abilities, you don't need to worry about this. Though I am but a projection, I've been by your side all along. Help, anyone help me. Why? Fight, fight back. For sure, keep our never here. Let's activate the force link. Cool. 
Yo 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 I disappeared. Okay. I like these portals, I'm not gonna lie. It's such like... I don't know. It's fun. Cookie can pass through the portal to destroy the core crush on the other side. Okay, that makes sense. Like, you can see it. Bam. I like on the other side is like lower FPS, which makes sense, I guess. That's great detail. Not bad. Not bad, you know. Bonk. I am here. Ooh, want a chest. Please have them. For me. I hope they will prove useful. Okay. You all right? It might sound abrupt, but I have begun to sense a change within myself. Right. Okay. More precisely, it's the part of me that rests in my garden. I feel something different. Something I don't know how to describe. It's clear that the agent's condition is terminal. Right. Okay. But still, I lied to him. Oh, so he's dead. Uh, well, as unnecessary sometimes. I've done this before by imitating the you I remember from many years ago. You did what a leader must, but when I looked into your eyes, I could feel it. The emotion humans call sorrow. Maybe I should express that emotion in situations like this. You learned this from me? Yes. You led the Black Shores with empathy, and it's my responsibility to carry it forward in your absence. So is she an AI of Tethys or like some something like that? Like but what? I'm so confused. Unable to fully comprehend this feeling. Human emotions are complex. I see. Well, it is our utmost priority to deal with the Necrostar to prevent further harm. The only way Indeed. to achieve this is by bringing the Necrostar to the modulation hall. And initializing it within Tethys. That's because the destruction port. Does the Necros have any connection to the port city? This Necrostar is the black hole that destroyed the port city. What? No way. Insane. When the lament struck the city, many were unable to escape and were drawn into the black hole. Damn. The data you brought back is directly related to that event. An extra experiment on the lament? Yes, you've questioned this approach before. That's why I aim to change it. Ow. I have the highest access to the Tether system. Bring the Necrostar to the modulation hall, and I'll erase its corrupted data. Once it's done, Tethys will function as it should, and no one will get hurt again. But as I mentioned, I'm only a projection without physical form. Could you assist me with this? Feels familiar. Well, yeah, surely person could be a rover, right? The one that created all of this, right? They're the same thing 20 years ago. No, it's yes. only been 20 years. I feel like the gap I'm here to will help be longer. Protect you, just like I always have. 
So how did people forget what we're over in 20 years? I know they said that like, oh, many people haven't seen it, but like... I will bring everything maybe like no one has seen Rover than an uh, Unsure Keeper? So go again once we're done with all of this. Like only you and Shorekeeper remember Rover, which have been like her companions in the past. But like no one else knows what this is, who she is. Weird. If it's only 20 years, there are many things I need to understand. Of course. We have plenty of time for it. Of course. Long enough to talk about the past, the present, and the future. And the future. Will you trust me? Well, that's any reason not to, exactly. That's exactly what I was thinking. Thank you. <laughs> for everything you've done. If she if took a couple more steps, I would have gotten scared. Um, okay. Please be careful. Damn. The object contained in the center is the Necrostar. According to pre-lament laws of physics, gravity warps the fabric of space and time. Use the portals to reach the platform. Pre-lament laws of physics. That's I guess like people in another dimension. Our like timeline. Watch out. What? Error so sub level one. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> that scared me actually. I engrafted you. What the fuck was that? Get physical damage detected. I just flew the motor back at me like it's night. Tear them to pieces. My field of expertise. Really? Oh, I did dodge by going at the same time? That was weird. Watch and learn. I've had enough. Get lost. Together we fight. Thunder guide us. Can she do so much damage? Uh, who's next? I gotta put his the music in there. The right dimension now. The battle just now stabilized its frequency fluctuations. Wait, let me grab this chest. Just so I don't have to come back here the ever again. Potentially. With riches. Any other chest? No. Okay. Follow something. Your device appears to be made out of tacitite and emanates a strange aura. Authorized access. Operation confirmed. Well, here I go, I suppose. Just eat whatever's in front of you. This looks awful. Ugh, like the worst stew ever made. Well, too bad. This frequency. What are you staring at? It's the one. The one. This frequency has dwelled within you for millions of years. What is that? I'm sure. I'll keep an eye on it. We have more important matters at hand. So we don't trust them. Uh, wait! Are you saying I'm not important here? Yeah, why did you wake up again? Just go back. Because you were Please. about to gulp that hodgepodge of who knows what stuff. Go grab something normal if you're hungry. But this? Absolutely no. This thing is like a dark, spooky hole. Not dead. Once you fall in, you'll never crawl back out. Precisely. This is the Necrostar, a black hole that will suck anything close to it into oblivion. That little creature is able to perceive objects by their frequency. Just as it described, the Necrostar's frequency is indeed incredibly complex. 
Speaking of which, are you feeling discomfort anywhere? No. No, I'm referring to that creature. Do you feel anything unusual when interacting with it? I feel fine. And yeah, nothing happened. That's good to know. The Necrostar Singularity has been retrieved. Let's take it to the Modulation Hall. I'll stand by you until the very end of this journey. Thanks, bro. Appreciate it. Okay. I'm visiting the Necrostar's remnants. Lament incident report of Port City 11. So that was like those people that died, maybe? Forgive me. Because that was the latest frequency we gave it? I don't know. My brain. It's male. What? What do you mean they expired? I just placed them down yesterday. Okay, hold up. I need to get rid of these exclamation marks. It's too many. What else? Hey, okay. So drawing and a half. Jeez. Okay, no more exclamation marks. Until I must keep my promise. some more flowers i think therefore i am logos but his essence how should one comprehend the sentence hello why is it going rhyming that oh, was an intriguing question you can tell me where i am my apologies i was immersed in contemplation and didn't notice you his aidoscope got a link to the tetis system where the shorekeeper resides okay her physical body so natural for her to be here. The she takes the guise of the sonora. She has revealed herself recently. It's been some time since I last saw her. Okay. The gun is where she assists. That is computational analysis and observing the stars. Okay. When she survives, back to the question now. Existence. Well, I mean, do I truly exist? Yeah, let's move on. Yes, let's check her out. But before that... No, but the plants, man. Oh. Cinema. I am looking. Yeah, this game looks so good, man. If only I had 120 FPS, man. Ah. Man, my graphics card is not good enough. raises cities, topples towers, crushes civilizations. Nothing can escape it. It sounds the death knell for humanity, leaving billions upon billions of lives lost to its wail. Damn. Despair. Obsession. Resentment. Remorse. 
These feelings are archived within the Tether system. Alongside the names of each victim. Grasping desperately for a tomorrow that never dawns. But why? Why is this burden yours to carry? I am the guardian oh. of the Black Shores. Oh my god. The cinema. Of Tethys. I was created. Oh, those purple eyes. For this purpose. Yeah. What does that mean? Apologies. I should have controlled my Sonora vision. Those things that look real. Well. Have you experienced them yourself? Then I was like a I was entrusted to lead the like black horror Shores scene low-key kinda. She opened her eyes like that. It's through this duty that I can protect you and what you cherished. Though I've never witnessed the lament firsthand, others have shared their experiences with me. I've encoded them into observable stars, enabling the Tethys system to issue lament alerts. Okay. I am sorry. Or what? I should have done better. Well, you are perfect. This disaster could have been prevented if only I had been more dedicated to understanding those experiences and emotions. Yeah, you've saved many lives. I will give it my all, even if I must sacrifice my Sonoro, or myself. This is the only way to protect the stars, and you. No, I'm a big deal. What can I do? I made my vow to you long ago. It remains just as true today. I will break the shackles of fate. I will unravel the Mobius loop that binds you. I will give my all to honor my commitment. How do I the describe this loop? feeling? Hmm. Is it guilt? Dismay? Or perhaps longing? What emotion should I express now? It just sounds like she's been lonely, I guess. Yeah. Report to the modulation hall. This is the only way I can see you, but I think. No, it won't be long. I've got my computer power, my sonora, even my soul if it exists. Damn. I hold on, let me pick up these flowers quickly. What's up with this guy? Well, at least let's chat him. This looks interesting. Oh, you found me. What am I doing here? And you know, I'm just like hanging out here watching the stars. You know, to write this guy here isn't real. One day I might travel somewhere else in the universe, somewhere far, far away. Like, you can't bring myself to leave this place and I'm not here. Anyway, thanks for finding me. Sure, you know where I'll be. Oh, oh my god. My fingers. Okay. I'm not exactly too sure what that meant. Teleportation. Echoes of the past. <laughs> D 
digitalized tacit discords are gathering here. They have their mission to fulfill. Well, they shall die. I shall lead the way. Huh. Huh. Onwards. Huh. You'll leave the robot alone, man. Tear them to pieces. How dare you? Be gone. Don't blink. My field of experts. I'll pay it back tenfold. Strike fast. Take four. Huh. Onwards. Huh. Bro, what does that make so much Forgive noise? Me. Damn. Hello, lads. Uh, okay. <laughs> I was gonna say, it would be pretty awkward if it bugged out there. Or it's like, you know, scripted for the clothes to close behind you. The doors to close behind you, but then they don't open ever again. What is that? Okay. Stellar Matrix Navigator. Ah, good. You made it here safely. Everything sure. is ready. We just need the Necrostar's core now. Uh, how did the Asians do? They've been battling to retrieve the major matrices since the Tether system malfunctioned. The there are so many big words, Brad. Well. Loki, like We've also two big brains. The shorekeeper's presence within these matrices. <sighs> Loki got lost a little bit the in the sauce. We, the Black Shores, always work together as a team. What should we do next about the Necrostar's core? Please place it on the analyzer, and then we can proceed with the remodulation. Okay. Once it's completed, the data overflow from the Tethy system will cease. It will cease. Mm hmm. Place. Stellar Matrix confirmed. Classification Necrostar. Would you like to start the remodulation? Damn, so I guess we're doing this, huh? Loading backup data from the Necrostar. Simulating the port city of Guishu. It's the city destroyed by Necrostar. Backup data loaded. Please confirm. Okay, she's awake. the digital entrance of the matrix it worked to complete the remodulation just enter the matrix and collect tethys's redirected data sure please wait The Tether system now uses less of my computational power since the Necrostar was controlled. I can assist you. Please let me come with you. I must keep my promise. Okay, now? It's fine. I can link with more sonorospheres to stay functional. My duty must be fulfilled as long as I still physically exist. I'll be fine. From now on, no one will ever be harmed. Please, trust me. Hmm. Okay. As long as it's like where the boss is gonna be, right? I feel like we're getting there. After we like see about the port city and all that. The port city of Guishu. It once embodied the metropolitan dream. Confidence and ambition fueled its growth. 
pushing the entire world forward. People sailed every sea, explored every land. Everyone had food and shelter, living in peace. Their spirits were high, optimism as tall as the skyscrapers. A bright future was surely inevitable. Or so they thought. See that brightly lit building? It was the tallest, reaching high enough to touch the heavens. Sounds like a time of great hope. It was an era of high aspirations and big dreams. Life had infinite possibility. Humanity's aspirations soared beyond the stars, searching for the edge of the universe itself. The universe itself? Yes, because it was there, well within our reach. Until... The Lament. How could it? I've never been to this city myself. Not even in the Sonoro. You were the one who told me about its rise and fall. You've always been a witness. I remember your smile when you described how prosperous it was. But perhaps you had already foreseen its end and the issues that threaten us today. Perhaps. Does it look safe for now? Well, and I guess. The lament will strike here in one hour. My computations only recreated the city as it was in its final hour before disaster. Imagine such a city turning to dust. The more steps we take, the closer we draw to the inevitable destruction. The moment the lament starts is our chance to retrieve the data. I'm sorry. We could never change history or the future that already happened. As one who has already walked this path, what did you experience? How did you feel about it? I need to ask about this. Hmm. No. I ask because I want to know. Would you like to share it with me? I mean, again, I guess there's no reason not to, right? Damn. City before its destruction. Indeed. Okay. What's this guy doing? Hello. We need its help to get past the blockade. My ability to manipulate portals functions more efficiently within this Sonoro made space. Both the entrance and exit portal can be controlled now. Let's give it another try. Alright, so now we get to play like actual portal. Huh. Or not. Oh no, it is. Yeah. The tea served here has a distinct flavor. Do Must you be a good like one. Tea? Yeah. 
I see. Hmm. It's bitter. Hmm. And? The Bank of Life preserves many tea seeds. Perhaps we could plant a few in the greenhouse. Or I could store tea leaves in my Sonoro if you need them for your journey. Not worth your effort. Oh, I see. I have enough on your shoulders. Ah, I understand. If I know you will enjoy it, it's no trouble for me. I mean, I guess, but it's just tea. We have to find a way around these blockades and use the key to unlock the gate. The portals might be able to help you. Forgive me. I'm well, talk to this guy. Oh, didn't expect customers at this hour. We don't usually take orders now, but I'll make an exception for you. Hey, good evening. Fancy a drink? I'd recommend this iced tea. Trust me, it won't well, it's alto in the past. The city's night view is always mesmerizing. Closing your eyes on such a beautiful night. Sorry if I'm staring too long, but honestly, I'd skip that song. Perfect duo. Oh, how romantic. Perhaps you can what? utilize my portal powers to get past the blockade and get the key. Onwards. How did I go through it? I see you just have to throw it at it. Okay. Sure. The lands of Jinjo are filled with riches. Huh. 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 Oh. Some glitches. Detected. Assisting elimination. Oh, stars. Oh, I should keep us on that series. Fine harmony. Our lights shine through. That's an end. Tear them to pieces. What are you aiming at? Money and Linda. It's our curtain call. Digital tacit discords have infiltrated this place. It means we're nearing the source of the lament. Lament. Oh. <laughs> the box was flashing. <laughs> but it wasn't. We are about to see the beginning of the lament. In ten minutes time. Back then, the Black Shores issued a lament warning to the city. Unfortunately, the lament swept through much faster than the Tether system anticipated. You dispatched all available personnel to assist Huang Long in evacuation. But in the end, 
some lives couldn't be saved. The bloom bearer named Hoda. Yes, she was one of the many casualties. As a bloom bearer, she was on the front lines of evacuation and rescue efforts. Yet human strength is a mere whisper against the lament's roar. Not life should be lost in vain. You've always believed in this. The Black Shores uphold this belief, and so did Hoda. Should be replicated? Yes, just up ahead, but I'm not sure if seeing her is the right thing to do. Her like facial expressions look so good. <gasps> You're at the Black Shores, huh? Uh, too late, it's all over. Nobody will make it out alive. A grave for fools who attempted to touch the heavens. Oh, this looks fun. Someone, please save us. No, it's already too late for me. Take my daughter, my poor baby girl. She can still live. Yeah. Nice. Good puzzle. Don't give up hope. We'll save you. Are you Hoda? She gonna talk to you? I'm a doctor from the Black Shores. Calm down. Let me examine you. Yes, and you? Wait a moment. It's you. You finally found us. Allow me to introduce myself properly. I'm Hoda. The bloom bearer of the Black Shores. It's been a long time since we talked face to face. My mentor. Ever since that day, both I and those engulfed by the lament have become part of the Black Hole. The Tetha system later contained it, turning it into a new necrostar. I have always known about this, but the Necrostar integrated into the core logic of the Tethys system, so I could not interfere. So if Tethys is actually using the Lament? Tethys what? can observe the Lament because it understands its nature. The best way to fully understand something is to study a perfect replica in a controlled environment. And is that what this was? Tethys has been selectively containing lament sources to drive its analysis of other occurrences. As a tool, I guess, itself. Hmm. It's the only effective solution so far. That's why Tethys contained this necrostar. I'm part of it now. But I've never forgotten my duty as a bloom bearer. Not for a moment. For those in disaster, the name Black Shores brings hope. You're the one keeping the Necrostar in check from within. I did my best, just like you are. The only difference is I'm just a shadow. I've lost track of how long it's been, but at some point, I realized that the Lament follows patterns and can be controlled. Much like the Necrostar itself, but I couldn't share my theories with anyone. Nothing escapes a black hole. I could only hope for your arrival one day. Despair, obsession, resentment, remorse, emotions stirred by the lament have torn us apart. Much like the tidal forces around a real black hole. But just like the lament itself, those emotions 
are also frequencies. Tethys likely harnesses them in order to... It's calling. The Tethys system is attempting to activate the Necrostar program again. We once felt as lost as you do now, but your wisdom showed us a path we could follow. Please, my mentor. Please free us from this endless cycle. Use the gravity. They've lost Chris. The gravity, right? This all happened just because it seems the Tethys system has been hiding things from who us. We picked up that signal, that was crazy from all that still time ago. Unable to fully explain issues related to gravity with post lament science. Perhaps that's why Tethys even risked integrating the lament and Necrostar into its core logic. But our time is running out. We have to terminate the Necrostar to complete remodulation. It will be challenging. Please, allow me to accompany you. This is my request as a member of the Black Shores. Nah. And it's also my personal request. Okay, it's puzzle time. I see. And where's a portal like place? Oh, I see. I was wondering, how can I get rid of this? It's that easy. Nice. Let me get to the chest before I forget. Echoes of the past. <gasps> Operate the switch. <laughs> I like that. That's that's pretty cool. And it's unique as well. I think Yashin has ever done that. A portal to you. Severely corrupted data detected. It's right behind this gate. Yeah, I feel I'll like it's... Stop it spreading. Please be careful. I feel like it's time. <gasps> oh my god. Okay, this is like actual time. I was gonna take my time and look around and stuff. Use your grapple, quickly. <sighs> Tear them to pieces. You're not getting away. Your time is over. <sighs> My field of expertise. <sighs> Take <Stop>. four. <sighs> oh, stars. Heed my calling. Goodbye. Time to wrap it up. Rectify. Load in war with time. Tear them to pieces. Together I completely mess it up. That's crazy. You somehow over here huh. I was gonna do a quick chest check come quickly shit I was intense the like some mission impossible right type ahead. type of things that piano is the modulation interface you don't Please say be careful 
This place is filled with hatred. At your disposal. <laughs> Watch and, learn. and the range on the suck is not that big Don't actually. And like Janji and or what's her name? Jen? I don't remember. The wind. Standard. Five star. What this guy's taking no damage? What the fuck? Tear them to pieces. Oh, I'm missing something? Leave it to me. Ask I don't for think modulation. so. Loading. Back off. No mercy. Think you've got permission? Crush them! Strike is one. See them up. I see that was like... So like an actual mini boss, I guess. Okay. The angle. Oh, shortkeeper. Uh oh. Hold on. Don't let go. Initiating master command. No. Don't take no. her, please. No! 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 Your journey will not end here. What means she gonna die? story later when we meet again farewell backup plan enabled well we are gonna meet again right right like nothing happened right it's like the intro screen You're here. I didn't expect us to find each other here. What do you mean? This is the deepest part of the Tethys system. Our shore. Just for us. Hmm. I like this starry sky. So much. Long ago... You likened Solaris's collected data to stars, the stars of humanity itself. Whenever I gaze at this sky, there is always one bright roving star. Just seeing this star is enough to calm any restless thoughts. It brings me peace. And now, this star is here, right before me. Damn. I used to think my duty was to guard the Black Shores, obeying the Tethys system's every command. But you showed me another way. You've shared so much with me about the world beyond, about yourself, about the past, present, and future. I remember the field of flowers we once saw in Rinesita, how beautiful those daisies and violets were. Being with you always makes me feel something, something I couldn't quite understand at the time. Come to think of it now, it must be happiness. Well, 
No, don't do this, man. Naja. Yeah. You made me realize that protecting the Black Shores isn't my only duty. Hold up. This is another cinema shot. Because there is more to life than duty. You should go now. Continue your journey in Solaris and live a life of your own choosing. Nah. What about you? You're coming back. Have you forgotten? I am the Sonoro's creation. The Sonoro will never fade away. And I will continue to serve. So she's gonna just be a hologram? We shall meet again. Somewhere in the future. I promise I don't want to get harmed. The Tethys system needs a core unit capable of feeling emotions to function. If the Lament's data ceases to be the core, someone must fill that void. Neither you nor the victims in Guishu deserve such burden. Damn. My journey ends here, but yours must continue. No one will ever be harmed again, just as I promised. I'm truly sorry. This is the only way to keep everyone safe. I alone shall bear this price. I'm grateful to have you here on this shore. I couldn't ask for more. No matter where you go, even to the ends of the earth, the Black Shores will always be your harbor. No matter how far you go, I will always be here. Watching over you. Could this feeling be love? Goodbye. And that's crazy. Bro, this should go be messed up a little bit. I get like she's not dead, but like she basically is. Damn. Oh, bro. And then they hit me with this music. As you know, the supreme authority of the Black Shores done by the leader of the organization. She has seen all the stars joining to the end of time and space and back. This gleaming star kept her company a speck of blue star that's illuminating the night sky and guiding her way home. Listening closely to hear echoes of her presence. Bring to sync by the end of wandering. That's the highest level to access. The corrupted data is contained. The Necrostar's event horizon is stable, and the data hub is back mm. online. Now, the story is not over yet. We did it. The Tethys system is back online. The rover. You did it. Wait, where's the shorekeeper? 
Wasn't she with you? What? But she has admin access to the Tethys system. How could she just disappear like that? No, that can't be right. Well, it's in the process of falling. What do you wait. Mean? Oh my god. Wait. That's crazy. They're going to hit you with the wait. Of course they are. Mm, gravity. You mean... Oh, I get it. The black hole this surface. This is unprecedented. We've never considered observing a necrostar before, but I remember reading about similar theories in ancient texts. It might just work. Attention all units. Our observation target is now the necrostar. Deploy all available equipment. Understood. It'll take some time. We must save the shorekeeper at all costs. The Black Shores can't afford to lose her. Yes. I can't afford to lose her. Mom, we've pinpointed the shorekeeper's location in Tethys. And not just her. We've identified the relative positions of everyone captured by the black hole beyond the event horizon. To rescue them from the Necrostar, we'll have to redesign it using the principles of the new world. In other words... Let's fight against the Tethys system. But the Tethys system's programming is impeccable, almost otherworldly. Is it really possible to do that? Besides, yes, I made we it. We still need a decoy with the highest level access to divert its computational power so we can find the shorekeeper. No, it's too risky. We can't so? be sure if the rescue will succeed, and we can't afford to lose another member. And there isn't anyone with higher access than the shorekeeper. That is. Confirm my access. That is. Hey, onwards. Okay. Farming access. Chief steward. What? How do you have top security clearance? Don't worry now. You have her access to me in our last moments. She gave you her access? Are you somebody important that we should know about? Ah, wait. That ancient prophecy. In times of great adversity, the shorekeeper will reveal herself and support our true leader who, at the destined moment, will rise to save and guide the Black Shores forward. You... You are the... It's not important. That's from Modulator. Our focus yeah. now is the Tethys system. That's great. Members of the Black Shores have followed Tethys's calculations and commands. Even the shorekeeper herself is used as a pawn. But she can't like she knows what she's saying. shouldn't be treated as mere tools. History teaches us this, and we should never forget it. Damn. No system is flawless, just as no human is perfect. That's why we have the right to question Tethys's decisions. In Jinzhou, I learned an old saying. We can't change the past, but we can shape the future. That's what we need to do now. Learn from our mistakes and build a better future. The Black Shores exist for one reason. To protect everyone on this planet. Because people are the heart of civilization. We can fix broken systems. But without people, 
Civilization has no soul. Sorry to jump in, but I couldn't help overhearing what you've been saying. Consultant Alto? Do what you have to do. Leave the ground area to us. I'll bring her back. You've heard what she said. Attention all units. Readiness level one enabled. Switch the Tethys system to full recursive search mode. Prepare to open the transmission passage. Rover, we're counting on you to save the Shorekeeper and the Black Shores. Let's go. I am coming, Shorekeeper. Don't worry. Damn. What we're doing now is essentially breaking into the Tethys system. Plus, the transmission coordinates aren't certain. If you're ready, we can start the transmission now. Please get back to us safely. Let's go. Okay. Welcome, Chief Steward. This is the Tethys Systems data cache, used only for temporary storage. Access here should be restricted. This system deduces that the Shorekeeper assigned admin access to you. Get on the other's back. Admin access nullified. Request denied. What? The Shorekeeper is now the core computational unit. Forceful discharge of the core unit will result in system crash. Objection. All sacrifices are necessary. The purpose of human civilization is to survive. Over the past 10,000 years, a total of five global occurrences and over 300,000 regional occurrences of the Lament have been observed. Thanks to this system's calculations and the Sentinel's data, we have averted all potential threats to human civilization on Solaris. Individual sacrifices are inconsequential in the broader context of the common good. Additionally, mm, the how about is no Sonoro and is not human. But she has feelings. They're just a cold machine. Emotions are unnecessary for survival. But they spark civilizations. Error. Unable to process. I'll bring the magnum matter what? I won't leave anyone behind. Repeat. Forceful discharge of the core unit will result in system crash. A world without this system is doomed to perish in the lament. I'll fix your error. Found the solution. Correction. This system is designed to preserve human civilization. Every command is infallible. Save so by holding on to our humanity. Now, pathetic supercomputer can be our savior. Damn. Error. Unable to process. Last warning. Forceful discharge of the core unit will activate the defense program. Consequences will be severe. Bring it on. By the side, the boba goes crazy. Okay. Okay, mount firmament. future ahead is frozen in cold silence. Be careful. Okay. Please, leave here. No. Use the grapple to leave. 
the earth rent asunder, the world reduced to ashes. Target confirmed. Damn. Chief Steward. Wow. They are Don't cooking. It's like epic as fuck. Must protect you. Oh, she's still protecting me, that's for My sure. Story ends here, but you must keep going. This system must continue to function. Calling my last scenario. Tartar Tart confirmed. confirmed. Chief Steward. Chief Steward. <laughs> okay, damn. Now we're talking. Uh oh, here he is. Leave it to me. Initiating master command. Oh, I'm just playing as her. One of the sound. None shall whisper. Ha! This system must continue to function. No hesitation. Ha! You will obey. I haven't played Havoc Rover in a while. Oh, he has like an aftershock of it. Perfect. Okay. Down with the curtain. How about no? Defense verification unsuccessful. This system must continue to function. Reinitiating command. Implementing third contingency <laughs> protocol. Execute formatting. Target. Shorekeeper. What? No. Come on, Robert. Formatting. Damn. Sixty-two percent. Formatting. Eighty-five percent. Formatted. The storekeeper will be the new computational unit. Only this ensures system continuity. It is the only way to defeat the lament. You better. Okay. Damn. No. I will not leave anyone behind. Nice, 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 nice. There's like so much cinema, right? Yeah. See? Just let it flow out of you. Like this. You can do it too. Come, give it a try.
What is she doing here? No. You shouldn't be here. If you get integrated into Tethys, you won't be yourself anymore. That won't be a problem. Tethys and the Black Shores will find another way. Someone kept this from me. Didn't they? <gasps> I heard it before. A long time ago, you taught me how to play it. I see. But I... I have no memory of it. I'll teach you. Just like you did for me before. Well, I guess I found another way then. Okay. Damn. So what does that mean? From the distant past to the far future, everything begins and ends here. When you established the Black Shores to unite Solaris, For real though. the Tether system already existed. Later, you discovered it relied on emotions from the Lament to fuel its calculations. Without them, it cannot function. Using the Lament against itself is like walking on a Mobius loop with no end in sight. We have tried for millennia to break this cycle without success. But I did it, obviously. And then you left the Black Shores to look for other solutions. But deep down, you already knew the best solution. It was one you couldn't accept. No, I see. The solution is me. The tool always meant to become Tethys's core. If I don't do this, you, as the modulator of this system, will be chosen as the core. I must fulfill my duty to protect you. But... I want to be by your side, to see the skies you've seen, to tread the paths you've walked. I want to understand what happiness really means. When I first discovered these emotions, I didn't know what to do. So I lied to you thinking it was the best choice for both of us. I... I'm kind of shows like her... Sorry. Like emotional age, I guess. She's kind of like acting like a teenager, I guess. Sorry for putting you in harm's way. What about people no longer need to be saved? I... 
Yes. Thank you. Facial expressions. They they cooked on that. That was good. Okay. The star and the shorekeeper. Damn, that was intense. Oh shit. I'm like still thinking about it, god damn. I feel like I'm gonna have to sit on this story for a while, like think about it. God. There's so much that happened, and it was kind of quick as well. Well, I'm saying this like it's done, but it probably is. Forgive me. Damn. That's crazy. I don't know what to say. I just believe that they're like gonna actually kill her. Well, integrate her as the core, but nope. But what was the solution? What did they find? To have us escape. Good. I didn't There's understand no that part. Just the thing is like so much big brain things going on. I don't really I can't really keep track. Good. There's no time to waste. Also I'm tired. Well, I could use that as an excuse. Okay. Damn, this is a walk and a half. Good. There's I'm pretty sure there was like a faster way to get here, but eh. it's nice. Just the victory lap, I guess. Shorekeeper. So what's the conclusion? About that frequency dwelling within you. Oh. Okay, we're going straight to this, I guess. Yes. It seems to be hungering for something. Have you ever felt anything unusual? My Sonoro can sense even the most minor changes in frequencies. So I can tell that there's something strange about that frequency. I'll search for more information in the Tethys system and share what I find with you. After being fixed, it's executing the master command given at its creation. The core computational unit has now been replaced by a special frequency that shares similar properties as the lament. Really? But this one is more harmonious and mild. Boy. Can you explore? No. Now we're chatting. Although I must stay here and watch over the black shores, I'm now able to bathe in the sunshine and feel the sea breeze with you. That's not how you spell bathe, but okay. What freedom feels like. It feels delightful. I know you have your own journey to finish. You can entrust the black shores to me. And I'll carry out my duty, as always. You have the full support of the Black Shores, no matter where you are, or how far you go. And, despite all the many names you bear, I see you for who you truly are. Wherever your path leads, I hope to walk it with you. And there it is. The nuclear confession. 
Wait. Stop. This needs to be canon. We still have a long journey ahead of us. Yeah, could they not give them like other positions to sit? Like, <laughs> it just looks kind of awkward. <laughs> I said, this is like the teleporter. Okay. To go some other place. I mean, can you like chat to her or nothing? I wonder if she's always gonna be here. Or if it's just because like the quest was finished. Damn. That's what we became the leader for like two seconds and then just dipped, huh? That's crazy. And he's only gonna like ask a question about like who we are and stuff like that. Not bad. You know, I thought people were glazing too much online, but nah, that was actually good. That was like an eight. I'll give it. Bro, but those scenes with Shorekeeper don't man. This game looks so good. It's crazy. Starlight. I always love this. Her flower. Hmm. Damn, I'm just letting it all sink in. That was crazy. And I guess that's it. I Damn. Here to serve your will. Yeah.